The winner of tonight's game will move on to the National League Championship Series. And for the loser, their season is over. It is the deciding game of the NLDS. Best of five between the underdog St. Louis Cardinals and the Philadelphia Phillies. Roy Halladay making his second start and was the game one pitcher for the Phillies. Well, these guys, when they get ready for a game, any game, every game's like a playoff game. They're very serious. They don't talk to anybody. They're into their mode. They're in the tunnel. And every pitcher in a game like this just wants to get into the flow. And sometimes it takes a little longer, Ron, to get into the flow. But if you can get into it right away, then it's just baseball's normal. Gary is behind the plate. And there's a drive hit to right center field. Victorino chases it, and it's over his head and off the wall. For call, rounding second and heading for third as the ball gets loose in the outfield end. A lot closer than expected with the ball getting loose. And Raphael for call with a leadoff triple to start the game. It doesn't matter if the Cy Young's on the mound. If you get behind these hitters, 2-1 count. They are going to tee off. Little fastball up in the strike zone by Hall Halliday over the head of Gold Glover Victorino in center field. And by the time he picks it up, he misses the cutoff, man. It bounces on nothing. So by the time Rollins gets it, a slide and a triple. For call with a leadoff triple. The 10th pitch of the at-bat and a line drive down the right field line. And it is a fair ball into the corner. For call will score and Schumacher will go into second with a double. So a pair of extra base hits, and the Cardinals have taken a one to nothing lead. And he gets jammed in a pop-up that Utley goes to third. And out at third base is Schumacher. And a ground ball to Rollins. He'll get the force, and that'll do it. Carpenter 11 and 9 and uh, pitched more innings than anyone in the National League with 237 and a third. You turn on the lights in postseason and he comes alive. And Utley strikeout victim here and there are two down on the first strikeout for Carpenter. And Freeze strikes out. He's got his man out there tonight. A line drive down the right field line. Fair ball into the corner. Lance Berkman goes after it. Victorino with speed. And he'll stop at second base with a one-out double in the first hit of the game for the Phillies. Malongo with a ground ball to Fercal. And that'll do it. The one-out double by Victorino. And he is stranded at second. You an advantage against him. Like that. Strikes out. Second strikeout of the game for... Holiday, who retires the side in order. It's 2.30. And Halliday strikes out. The 1-2 pitch. Chases an outside pitch. Strike three. Threw him out of third. Cardinals left two on base in that inning. And three strikes out for the second time in the game. And four strikeouts for Halliday. Ground ball. Base hit to right field by Victorino. Hunter Pence will go to third, and the Phillies have runners at first and third and two away. Victorino two for two in the game. Runner off at first, and a fly ball hit to right field. Lance Berkman on the warning track, and he makes the catch to retire the side. Close for Raul Abanez as the Phillies lead two. Squaring around, and there's the bunt. There. And it's a double play to the right side and Utley on the outfield grass playing it perfectly makes the play three ground balls three outs for Halliday into the Phillies with only two runs there goes the runner Utley going there's the throw to second they get him Chris Guccione, the second base umpire, and you just said it, Ron Darling. Yadier Molina, and after a good jump by Utley, taking a while to get in the groove, six of the eight base runners with the first two innings. There's a drive hit deep to center field. Victorino back and makes the catch on the warning track right in front of the 409 foot sign. Another most difficult. And Molina. 
out on strikes. And that'll do it in the seventh inning as Punto strikes out. And gets the green line and a line drive to Berkman in right field. And out number one. And Carpenter gets Ryan Howard after falling behind 3-0. and So important here in the last couple of innings. One hopper to Nick Punto. And a 1-2-3 inning for Chris Carpenter. Games every year. There's for a call with the bunt. Ruiz going to second, and it's safe at second base as Jimmy Rollins. To O'Bunt. Perfect down the third base line, and Polanco getting it over to Utley for the force and the sacrifice, for the out and the sacrifice. Sends runners to second and third, and you know, the way Carpenter was running to second on that first play, you knew that he could motor over to third. goes down. Big out number two for Roy Halladay. And a drive hit to left field. Abania is coming on over and makes the catch to retire the side. And Ron Darling, your observation right on the money. This crowd pumped up as Halladay retires the Cardinals with the bases loaded. And the Phillies trying to capitalize on getting out of the last inning. But here's for call, and he throws out Polanco for the third time. And there's one away here in the eighth. Round ball, and smothered by for call, recovers and throws him out. Raphael for call, acquired from the Dodgers and paying dividends at shortstop since his acquisition. All of these special performances seem to always take a little magic with the leather, and that's the magic there by Fertal. 14 ground ball outs, none bigger than this one right here. Two outs in the eighth, he gets up, knows the runner, and has a strong arm. Nice follow through. There's a shot off the glove of Carpenter. From the first base, and in time, Punto and for call, both making sparkling plays here in the eighth inning. Converted 32 of 35 save opportunities in the regular year. 2-1 pitch, and can't find it. Ryan Madsen can't find it, but a great recovery by Carlos Ruiz to throw out Molina. Descalso goes down for out number two. One two pitch. And Punto strikes out. Matt Matson strikes out two. And now the Phillies, with all their success, have one more at bat to reach leading off an inning when he was hit by a pitch in the fourth inning. First pitch. Drive hit the center field. John Jay is back and makes the catch on the base of the wall for out number one. Ground ball to Descalso at third. Two gone in the bottom of the ninth inning. And fittingly, the Phillies, who are down to their last out, will have Ryan Howard coming up. would be surprised if he doubles up. He did not make a good pitch there. This is not a guy bothered by the tension of finishing a game. This guy's been there before Carpenter. Look for him to make the adjustment right here. Ground ball to the right side. Puncho has it. And running over, and the Cardinals have done it. The St. Louis Cardinals, improbable in making the playoffs. And Ryan Howard is down. He is hurt halfway between home and first base. So Howard is hurt, and the Cardinals are celebrating. Out around first base. Chris Carpenter with a brilliant pitching performance, but a concern for Ryan Howard here. As soon as he came out of the box, I don't know whether he turned his ankle or if it's an Achilles problem, but no chance he could make it down to first base. 
as the Cardinals celebrated. A discouraging finish to the Phillies season. They put this team together to go to the World Series. Howard is hurt, but what about the St. Louis Cardinals? A never say die team, John Smoltz, who were seemingly out of the wild card. They were eight and a half back in September to the Braves, and they win this series in a decisive fifth game on the road.